What is going on guys, Miles here, back again with another video, today we're going to be playing some more Black Ops 3 Live on Fringe, we're playing some Team Deathmatch with the Man of War, which is probably my favourite assault rifle uh, before the KN44, which is also sick, because uh, this thing is like super high damage, pretty low rate of fire, and I'm a big fan of it, I'm going for gold currently, don't even have gold yet on the Man of War, which is depressing, because people have like dark matter, and then there's me with like barely any gold weapons and that guy is too good so I'm gonna just go this way go to mid uh, with all my teammates and we're gonna push through here let's go up see where we end up there's one guy by van no take him out down. rocking some pretty low streaks actually uh, UAV counter UAV and the dart because we're playing some team deathmatch really and it's quite hard to get streaks on TDM especially without uh, combat focus but we're rocking gravity spikes, which is a bit weird. I don't think I've ever used gravity spikes in a live com. But actually, I'm going for the hero armor, so I have to do challenges with gravity spikes. I need to try and get some double kills with it. So I'm going to be on the lookout for that. Ooh, cheeky. No, one off the UAV. Got a cheeky double there. Not too bad, but four on one. Let's see what we can get. Using this man of war. I don't even know what attachments I'm actually using for this thing, honestly. I'd have to find out. But I typically use red dot, obviously, and grip and stock, and maybe quick draw, but definitely grip and stock for the Man of War. It's just a must-have, really. It does recoil quite a bit. I mean, you might be able to get away without grip, because grip only does reduce it by a tiny bit, but in my opinion, it's worth it for the Man of War. What the f*** is that guy doing? No! We're two off our UAV that time. What are we doing? We're choking pretty hard right now. Uh... Got the gravity spikes. Uh, let's just kill that guy. This thing is so OP. It's literally like a one bullet kill in hardcore at any range, I think. At least when I was using it, I was getting mad one shot kills with the Man of War. Need to actually, like, get some streaks going, though. Oh no. Not like this. Let's try out this Semtex. There's a guy, like, right there. What the hell? Oh, I got to kill the Semtex. It worked. Sandex is actually pretty good, and I think I had like a spare point, so I just threw it on. Ooh, we got a UAV. Let's go. Is there a guy right there? Yeah, there is. Oh my god. I thought that was an enemy. That was scary. Ooh, we got our streaks. Let's go. Oh my god, what was that? Jesus. Oh my god, this is scary. We're in like the middle of a battlefield right there. We got the head glitcher. No, there's one more. Damn it. We were in the middle of like no man's land there. That was scary, but we got the streaks. That'll help out the teammate a lot. And we're gonna pull in this dart, which is a pretty awesome streak actually. It's pretty good if you use it correctly. There's one. No, we missed the second one. Oh, okay. That was terrible, honestly. Uh, we got one kill of it. It's, it can be pretty good, honestly, if you use it correctly. And that guy was scary of his tempest. You can get like up to three kills of it if you're pretty accurate with the explosive rockets. Spotter killed. Man, I don't like this area. You can easily get like sniped and stuff. It's scary. So I'm just gonna go to mid. Mid works out pretty well for us. This thing's so good at long range, which is really good on a map like Fringe. I don't think I've actually done a best class setup for it, which I do plan to do at some point. But who knows when. I haven't done a best class setup in so long. No, that guy will one off the UAV. We keep getting like one off and dying. But overall, we're actually having a decent game. 19 and 4. And our team is doing work. With the KD right now. Ooh, Scythe, man. That's scary. Scythe is really good. Scary going up against it with a man of war. We're doing pretty well. I'm happy with this. I haven't played many games today as well. That's quite cool. I haven't used the gravity spikes, but they're pretty situational and I haven't found a good time to use them. Oh man! What? Where the hell? Oh, he's there. That sucks. Wait, they got a hater? Are you serious? That must have been from a care package. That is. Oh, that is annoying. <laughs> I was using a care package in my last live gone. And I got a Wraith, I think. It was pretty cool. You should check that out. And this guy just got a hater in his care package, and that makes me a hater. I'm mad at him for getting a hater in the care package. 
There's a guy who usually sits around that yellow container. Can't really see. Yeah, there's That's one. I'm not sure how long the hater lasts in this game, but like 40 seconds, so should be running out pretty soon. And our team has like a decent lead. We got 19 Hostile kills up. We got a, oh, what? We had that spawn. We had this spawn. I don't know how there was someone behind me. Man, that was bad death. We should have had that, but... That was a pretty dumb play, not gonna lie. Actually, the man of war isn't too bad for this, like, corridor. Because it's got such good, like, range. It would absolutely shred, as long as they're not using a sniper. In which case, I'll be rip. but... I'm gonna get these gravity spikes going. The game's about to end. We've got to be careful. Let's just lurk around here. There should be one in this building. Or not. <laughs> Never mind. Where are there? There's one there. Nah, we didn't get to pick him off. They're lurking around here, I can tell. I'm scared. Oh, there's a double there. I needed doubles of gravity spikes. Oh! There we go. We got one. Kill an enemy a hundred times. That's pretty cool. We got a new cooling card. Oh my god. Sam's X saved me. Oh! That guy just got played. Got a UAV. Can we get more streaks? The game's about to end, so we need to like rush out if I want to get these. But it, they were destroying my UAVs earlier, so... I'm not too bothered about the UAV. There we go, rip. Where are these guys? There's one. Put in the counter for like five seconds before it gets destroyed. Oh no. Oh, luckily we got tack mask. I always rock tack mask because honestly, like flashbangs and. Oh no! Oh man, how don't I see that guy just sitting in there? He was patient to be fair. He must have been there for ages. Fortunately, he died. And I almost died again, which would have been really bad. Can we get the final kill? Can we get it? Let's go for a mad wall run. Jump off. Find nobody. That vision pulse. Oh, we're tagged. We're just on the outskirts of that uh, vision pulse. One more kill. We need the last kill. Commit to it. Yeah, we got the winning kill. 30 and 7. Not too bad at all. Carried the team a little bit there. Me and Shay Wright. We carried the team because they all went negative. But overall, pretty good game. We had a 17 kill lead. And that is why I love the Man of War. We were using quick grip. Oh my god, I can't even speak. Grip, quick draw, and stock on the Man of War, which is pretty cool. Really, really good class setup. Oh man. Uh, you guys should definitely try it out. But overall, I hope you guys enjoyed this live commentary. Be sure to subscribe for more live commentaries. And I'll see you guys in my next video.